there are a lot of really complex technologies behind doing this kind of set of activity. We trained a voice model, for instance, to say your name and the person who you're inviting. Jennifer actually says that name out loud. Hello, Jane. Jennifer Lopez here, Virgin Voyages Chief Celebration Officer. John told me you deserve to celebrate an anniversary with a voyage. So get on board. We had to get her to read these long scripts of, of absolute nonsensical words. I'm glad I didn't have to be the guy to ask Jennifer Lopez to read 10 pages of absolute nonsense into a microphone. My name is Billy Bohan Chinike. I am the Director of Global Brand and Experience Strategy for Virgin Voyages. Hi, I'm Ryan McManus, Chief Creative Officer at VML YNR, based in New York. I'm Brian Yamada, I'm Chief Innovation Officer at VML YNR. Hi, I'm Dave Myers, I'm the Director of the Virgin Gen AI Ad. We, at the end of 2022, went back and looked at everyone who had taken a voyage with us and tried to kind of extrapolate the reason why. And what we ended up being able to look at was people came on board to celebrate with us. It wasn't just about birthdays or anniversaries. They were kind of making up their own reasons to celebrate too. Things had been missed out in the pandemic. Uh, people were wanting to celebrate again, wanting to get together with families and friends. And what we noticed was that there was one real barrier to getting these bookings over the line, which is organizing everyone. And so what we wanted to do was figure out a way to help people who wanted to come on board do that a little bit more easily. Everyone was talking about generative AI. So we decided it was time to make our own version of Gen AI and have a bit of fun with it. And so that's where the, the kind of genesis of this came from. What is a way that we could get a little bit of information from somebody? And we developed this tool around those prompts, kind of like any other AI tool, right? You give it a bunch of information and then it gives you something. How did you go about coming up with the concept of using a Gen AI tool and then making it real? It was really just working arm in arm with the creative team. So the team really looked at how to make sure that all the different aspects of Virgin Voyages were looped in to the experience. So set up a, a whole concierge experience to walk through the planner, let them put in their name, let them put in the occasion, let them put in the name of the person that they were trying to invite, and then show them all the wonderful things about the experience to make sure that they were excited about it and the way that they were gonna get their guests excited about it. The actual generative portions, ironically, were relatively narrow. We were really just trying to figure out how to make sure that we're taking a celebrity with the status of Jennifer Lopez and making sure that she looked and sounded correctly by saying my name, saying the guest's name, and talking a little bit about the occasions. Okay, John, let's show Jane everything this ship has to offer. We actually engaged with Jennifer and her team back in 2020. When we found out there was a strategic partnership with Jennifer Lopez and the brand, we thought, who can say no to JLo? As we were chatting through during a strategy meeting with her team, one of the insights that they shared with us is that she, in fact, loves to celebrate. And so when we told them what we were developing, they're like, well, she would love to be involved. So the idea came to turn Jennifer into the person who helps invite people on board. Hi, it's me, Jennifer Lopez, Chief Celebration Officer of Virgin Voyages, here to invite you to celebrate. What was the process then of creating the tool and working with Jennifer Lopez. The first challenge is, is working with Jennifer Lopez's schedule, then trying to match that with the schedule of a passenger ship. Jen's one of a kind. She's one of the few celebrities that moves at a rate that is so fast. I think she fit in a couple of her own advertising while doing ARC ad. All of the stuff that you see in the ad is actually her on the ship. It was actually done on a turn day. So the one voyage finished, we shot for the entire day on board. And then as the shoot was finished, Finishing, an entire new set of sailors was getting on board. For the spot, we developed characters that she could lean into and play into. She's playing these different personas. That's a choice that she's going to make. We could guess what she's going to do, but she's going to have to make those choices. Then she would build on that and we'd collaborate so that she could have a performance. And then we actually cast people to match 
ultimate performance. The actors, when they were putting on the AI equipment, were watching Jen, so they were able to have the most tools to actually imitate that correlation. We worked with them on making sure that we were highlighting our brand's pillars, and then we developed a set of narratives around them. So you'll see her spend time on one of the signature spaces that we have on board called Richard's Rooftop, in an eatery, in the spa. We also are known for our hammocks. So you'll see her spend time there as well. On top of that though, we had to capture a lot of technical parts, getting her framed right, getting her voice in a specific way. We added little glitches and elements. It really helped on two fronts. One, it leaned into the fun. JLo did a great job of expression and leaning into the creative idea. And that glitchy aspect kind of kept to make sure that it tied into the core of that fun and the humor and the concept. The second is it also helped to introduce to people where the AI was jumping in. So it helped with transparency. They knew when the name was being generated and the occasion was coming through that that was the little generative piece. Can you tell us any, any of the, the results that you saw from it? The people who are booked on a voyage or thinking about booking a voyage, what we've heard from them is that this is the first time where they can use a piece of advertising to help convince their friends and family to join them. Kind of a strange process, but but a fun one at the same time. Working very tightly between the, the kind of concept teams, the brand teams with the CX teams within VML YNR to kind of stitch it all together and our tech partners that helped uh, build some of the platforms. It was really quite fun with the agency. I really felt we were trying to make something good and trying to do something funny. And Virgin was really trusting in that way. And even the actors in the studio, it was just a wonderful group. They were doing some improv and they were all just funny people and having fun together and it was a fun day.